take it off. Man, a commute this morning. Oh, the weather. I didn't think it was going to be wet like this. But I'm riding anyway. A couple of weeks ago, Volts and I were riding around, took the day, and, you know, having a great time, riding, chatting, and I decided that what I wanted to do was redo the audio setup in my helmet so that I could capture uh, the audio when we went riding, you know, coming over the car down. Uh, and then, of course, for, you know, group rides and stuff, that'd be kind of cool to be able to capture that. But I didn't want to do it the way everybody else that I've talked to says to do it, uh, which is stick a mic up by the speaker in your, uh, your helmet. What I want is to capture the audio, clean audio, coming directly off the car now, putting it on one channel of my GoPro while recording the, the audio coming off my vlogging mic and putting it in a completely separate channel on my GoPro. This way in post, I can work with those two channels independently of each other. I can level them, I can edit, do all kinds of cool stuff. So that was the challenge that um, I kind of gave myself. And um, I've, I've got the stuff hooked up in the helmet. I want to walk you through uh, the solution that I came up with. Did a little pretest um, <clears throat> this last weekend with, with Anna, but I had a few problems, and I think it was because of her Senna and how uh, that's hooked up and then working over Bluetooth. So I'm going to be uh, getting with Volts here in a couple of days, and we're going to do a test over the Cardo mesh and uh, see how it works. So hopefully this, the end of this video will be that test, and we will verify that what I'm about to, uh, to show you actually works amazing. <laughs> To accomplish what I'm trying to do here, there are three things that you need. One is a splitter. There's a male on one end and two females on the other. We need a 3.5 millimeter patch cable. And I'll show you what this is for in a second. And then you need um, one of these. Now, this actually looks like a splitter, but it's not. We are not using a splitter here. This is a stereo breakout adapter. And what this is made for is to plug the male in into a stereo jack and then split the left and right channels out. Um, so you could have like one channel go into one speaker and, and the other channel go into another. We're actually gonna use this to do the reverse. We're going to have the feed from the Cardo plug into one of these and then we're going to have the uh, vlogging mic plug into this. And what will happen then is it will pass that signal uh, onto the GoPro into a left and right track or left and right channels on the single audio track that's in the GoPro. That way we can split that track out um, in the editor and edit each channel separately. Okay, so let me show you how that, that looks then when we hook it up. Okay, hopefully you'll be able to make this out. I've got everything hooked up. So this cable here is my Cardo. Normally your helmet speakers will be plugged into here. And what I've plugged in instead is the, uh, the splitter, the male end going into the female of the Cardo. Good work, get out of here. Then on the other end of that splitter, I have uh, my speakers, my helmet speakers, plugged into one female. Then on the other female, I have this 3.5 millimeter uh, patch cable that's running from this side of my helmet on top of the liner and then out over on this side. So that's the input side. Uh, and then over here, I have the stereo breakout cable. This is going into the GoPro. And I have the, uh, the Cardo from that patch cable coming into one channel and then I have my vlogging mic plugged into the other channel. So this breakout cable will actually put those two channels together on a single track in the, um, in the GoPro. So then when you get to the editor, you can break those channels out and edit them independently. That's the theory. 
Uh, I'm gonna go hook up with volts and we're gonna give this a quick test to make sure it works. And hopefully what we're gonna have at the end of the day is clean audio coming from the Cardo, clean audio coming from the vlog mic uh, into something that I can uh, level and edit separately. Let's go see what happens. Here's a quick and dirty diagram showing how I have everything connected in the helmet. And also make sure you check out the description of the video. I have links to all the cables that I use for this. Hey, Volts, what's up, dude? How's it going? Hey. Yeah, it's too bad. It's uh, too cold to ride outside. Is it? <laughs> yeah, and well, now we're kind of like walking around with our helmets on and the store looking like Daft Punk. Yeah. But uh, we're out at uh, Harley, or at uh, Patriot Harley Davidson, uh, trying to do an audio test on this new hookup to see how this works over mesh. Because uh, I got an idea about doing some really cool uh, mode of vlogging while Volts and I are riding together. Dude, I think we could have like adventures of Percy and Volts going on. Because we always talk about cool stuff, about bikes and life and tech and stuff. But we're out here looking at the new anniversary fat boy oh i think i think volts is uh i think volts is uh in love hey what's your name man randy 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 percy nice to meet you nice to meet you too yeah we're doing a little uh youtube uh oh, okay all right uh can you Say some stuff and let me make sure I'm getting the audio coming out. Sure, sure, sure. So this is uh, hopefully my next bike within uh, one to ten years. It might be now, it might be later, but it looks amazing. I love the engine finishes here with the brass color. That's absolutely amazing. That's what I want to do with my bike, and this one comes stuck with it. So uh, it looks beautiful yeah you know i'm looking at this and you know you look at what you've done with martha and it, this is pretty much what you've been trying to do with martha man it is yes it is yeah that engine looks i mean awesome. those these um particularly these uh push root covers are amazing just that makes the bike worth it well you know everything I just, else i just did this in black on uh on Sophie, I don't. I didn't see where they sold that color. I don't know if they're. Uh... I don't think this color is available ever. I think this is special edition for this type of, but this particular bike. Like I, I wouldn't think anybody sells this color. I, I would love to get that. It looks amazing. I, I'm sure you can get this, the, the engine, uh, this whatever cover for the. You know, with with enough top. money, you can get anything from Harley Davidson, dude. I'm really tempted. Oh, check it out! Look who's here, Anna, the Vespa girl. What's going on, Anna? Hey. You should get it, Anna. It fits you. It does. It does. Uh, when I was standing there, you sat on it. Yeah, it looks. It looks good. Well, you look good on it. Hey, guy, I think you know we we've got two fat boys and whatever this is that looks friggin' amazing. So we should get all three. <laughs> and then we can just go riding around. So, Percy, which one? Which one would you get? Would you get this one? No, nah, that's still too. You know, that's not my thing, dude. I, you know, I, I love my Fat Bob. Um, I got to tell you that Fat Boy is. If I didn't have Sophie, and I was just buying a bike, it might just be this Fat Boy. Man, but you know, I love my Fat Bob. I love Sophie. She's very good to me. We're having a lot of fun. Maybe Sophie needs a sister. Oh hell no, dude. I, I <laughs> would, you know, I'd love to stay married. That ain't gonna fly, bro. I, I want to this city is actually really comfortable for a long trip, so if I will have to get in there. I don't know. That seat looks. I mean, it felt comfortable when I sat. Much more comfortable than mine. I got. I, I think I got ass problems on on mine. You need to ride for two hours to see if the yeah. the seat's really comfortable. I, 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 like it, it would require no lines if I have to raise this a little bit. Yeah. All right, I'm going to turn off the video. Uh, hopefully, this test worked. Um, for now, say goodbye, guys. We'll see you later. Bye -bye. Goodbye, guys. Adios. See you later. All right, there you have it. 
I'm pretty happy. Everything seems like it's working exactly the way I wanted it to. I'll do a follow-on video on how to edit uh, the audio uh, once you bring it into, into your editor uh, to kind of keep this video not so long. But um, I've got all the wires all tucked away. I might run this inside the helmet and put a little extender on here to make it a little cleaner, but uh, I'm pretty happy. Uh, one thing I do want to make sure that you take note of is that all the connections that I ran here are TRS. That means they have two black rings on the tips of um, all the wiring components. If you have a mic that is for a smartphone, that is TRRS. So it has three rings on the tip. You're going to have to convert that to a TRS uh, with a little converter uh, before you put it in the breakout cable. All right, there you have it. Looking forward to doing some really cool uh, dual vlogs or multi-vlogs or whatever you want to call them in the future. Until next time, peace.